The next slide is my special interest. Go for it. Go off. This is queen. this is okay. So again, this is kind of a this one is it is a communist car in the sense that like it was it started in a company that wasn't communist to begin with, and then you know World War II happened, some things changed. Uh, this is a Tatra. Uh, it is the third oldest car company in existence. Mm. Um, and it is genuinely communist in the way that uh, these ca their cars that they built absolutely fucking love to kill Nazis. Uh, it's probably <laughs> yeah. the thing they're most famous for. Is the, the headlines <laughs> just turned blood red. <laughs> yeah, it was infamously good at killing Nazis. Um, this is one of the first streamlined cars ever built. So this is, this is a uh, Tatra 77 right here. It came out in 1934. Um, so the Chrysler Airflow Whoosh. came out around the same time. You know, it's Modernism. it was people were starting to think about the possibility of aerodynamics because you could finally like shape sheet metal, sheet metal beyond just like oh, we built you two boxes and taped them together. Um, but nobody was really working with it. this car. Actually, had like a point two seven or something uh, coefficient of drag. Um, and next slide, please. Oh. So just to just to push drive this home really quick, this is what a Mercedes yeah. Benz looked like in 1934. This is a this is oh never mind, I take it back. Some fucking <laughs> yeah, 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 okay, respect. sorry, sorry. This, this not is a Nazi 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 before yeah. you started approving of it. Yeah, yeah. but this is a, yeah, this... I, I was gonna say something, but I figured I'd let let me stew for a second. <laughs> Oh, the fact that in the notes is a quote from Hitler saying he likes it. Wow. 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 The, yeah. wow. Why don't I it's ever read that? fucking oh, over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can't oh, believe Bobby you canceled. love Hitler. Oh, <laughs> Turning the oh, Hitler oh. particle <laughs> detector on myself. Oh, oh my God. God. I finally got this oh. podcast canceled. I can't believe it. It took like, <laughs> yeah. what, nine guest appearances? Yeah, and, you, yeah, and then right. you tricked two thirds of us into becoming yeah, you Hitler. You tricked, yeah, two people into becoming Hitler. Yeah. <laughs> We got two uh, Hitlers the, on this podcast. All of the polls now. are pure of heart. <laughs> exactly. Um, <laughs> so, in any case, this is this is what a, a Hitler car looked like in 1934, right? So I'm booing. For Boo. comparison, Boo. you know, you have this streamlined, beautiful piece of art the Czechoslovakians have built, um, uh, which is the Tatra T77, and then you have this this you know it phallic, disgusting fascist car. Of mm. course, okay. yes, yeah, I hate yes, it so yes, much. yes. <laughs> um, hey, so, hey guys, hey guys, what did the first Hitler say to the second Hitler? <laughs> what? It's whatever you two are talking about right now. God, fuck <laughs> you! Oh, <laughs> don't leave that. Leave it in. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you were saying, Victoria, before okay, before so. Roz ru rudely interrupted you, not us. <laughs> <laughs> well, so, yeah, you were having a Hitler conversation. <laughs> Uh, um, so in any case, like this is the, the the Nazi strategy to cars was kind of similar to like the American strategy to building cars, which was just more displacement. Throw it at the problem. Eventually, the car will go faster. Um, so you have these enormous hoods. These cars are not very like like this. They aren't super refined yet. Um, so when the Nazis invade Czechoslovakia in 1937, uh, they freaked the fuck out at the Tatra. They were like, "What is this thing? This is insane!" Because even as early as 1934, the T-77 is like, it's like a modern car, right? Like, it's like quiet on the freeway. You can drive it like it's on a freeway. It can do 55 miles an hour, and it's fine. Which is not something that cars in the 30s were very good at doing yet. So, Str the quote strange from <laughs> Adolf a, Hitler to God Ferdinand Porsche it, in 1937 ah. says, that, referring to the Tatra T-77, is the car for my highways. Wait, 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 wait. So Hitler was talking, you know, just talking about the first car. So yeah, yes. you're Hitler. Yeah, yeah wow. not us. Yeah, not wow. us. No, wait. No. no. Yes, no, next, you're Hitler. Next you're slide, no, you're Hitler. Next slide, please. <laughs> oh. All right, are we going to oh. finally figure out which of us is Hitler? <laughs> yeah. It's, it's you. Ross. Uh, <laughs> I, oh, my God, it was Milkshake all along. <laughs> So <laughs> died 1945, <laughs> born 2023. <laughs> Welcome back, Adolf Hitler. And it's just a just picture just of Milkshake. <laughs> <laughs> so this is this is the this this is the <laughs> God damn it. I think I think Milkshake's actually from 2013 or so. I, I don't I don't know how old your Hitler cat is. I'm sorry. I actually don't know either. I don't think uh, I don't think uh, my friend LJ who actually. 
is the owner of Milkshake knows either. No, um, you, you no, one. no one knows. No one knows. Milkshake, Milkshake is timeless, owner, really. Yeah. So this is the this is the rear of the Tatra eighty seven, which is a similar car that you know came out around the same time. Uh, same design. It's an iteration over the seventy seven. Beautiful. This one had a two point nine liter air cooled V eight that made eighty five horsepower. Can I say this is beautiful without axle. getting called Hitler? Yeah, this is this is beautiful. Thank this is you. the car I want. Yeah. Um so it could do a hundred miles an so hour. Then you can be Hitler. <laughs> I'm not Hitler. <laughs> It's like it's like the opposite of that game Secret Hitler. It's like extremely <laughs> like latent Hitler. Not latent. It's an, Abbott, Abbott, and, it's an Abbott and Costello bit, but instead of the Over who, who's Hitler. on first. Yeah, no, it's actually every every player is named Hitler. <laughs> Secret Hitler, but everybody gets a Hitler card is Yeah. <laughs> See how long that takes to fuck everything. <laughs> <laughs> Dealing a bunch of Hitler cards into like fucking uh like apples to apples. <laughs> apples to Hitler is not my favorite game. Adults wow, to you adults. Do a, you do a you do a murder mystery dinner party, but it turns out that actually everyone is Hitler. Yeah, it was it was Colonel Hitler in the fall. <laughs> <laughs> Let me guess, it was in the fewer bunker with a revolver. <laughs> yeah, sometimes less research is more, you know what I mean? This is the one I actually did all the research on. <laughs> well, sometimes more research is more, I guess, and the rest of the podcast's gonna be fucked. In a world <laughs> where everyone is Hitler, oh. only uh, one man can restore sanity. Yeah, the Hitler vest. Is it also, is it also <laughs> Hitler? <laughs> no, no, it, it stars Joseph Stalin. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, it better be Stalin, man. <laughs> <laughs> Slowly panning across the street, every man, woman, and child, little postage stamp mustache, even the babies. <laughs> There's a baby in a stroller with the <laughs> little little postage stamp mustache. <laughs> Oh, okay, get it together, get it together. <laughs> Delirium. <laughs> I'm fine, I'm going <laughs> Are we wow, recording this is wow, like wow. midnight your time? Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah this yeah, is yeah. like the third thing I've had to do today, and that's like three too many things for me on any given day. <laughs> can, um, you, can you believe this, folks? November thinks Adolf Hitler is funny. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this is thank God this is going on the main feed. <laughs> Tell me about this fucking car. Man. Um. Okay. So anyway, pictured here is a Tatra eighty-seven. Mm -hmm. Um. This is the one that's just, it's easier to find stats on because it's like a more modern car. They it's a good thing it's an eighty-seven because it was a Tatra eighty-eight. It would be even more Hitler, you know. <laughs> yeah. oh, no. um, <laughs> This, so, this podcast has reached levels of Hitler previously <laughs> unprecedented. People tried to warn us anytime they said anything about Ukraine. I, oh, yeah, myself, out I came out and talked about cars. This is inevitable. <laughs> the, the, the dealership disease is setting in. <laughs> yeah, I, uh, I'm going to get a black sun tattoo and uh... <laughs> Jesus. Do you have a uh, do you have any lease deals for me on a new Silverado? I told you, yeah, I, I just said I have a black sun tattoo, so obviously I also run a, a car dealership. Do you not pay attention to any of your reading material? You guys remember the plot of the Wolfenstein reboot from 2008? That's basically me. Oh, great game. <laughs> um. Anyway, All this right. car was really good. Uh, about the T-77, Wilhelm Heinz from Motor Journal <laughs> oh, in 1934 said, It is a sensation when it comes to its construction, to its appearance, and to its performance. However, it isn't a sensation that has just fallen from the skies, but it is a logical extension of the roads themselves, which Hans Ledwinka made 13 years ago. I remember I looked up who Hans Ledwinka was as for this specifically, and then I forgot. Um, I'm going to blame the medication. 
Mm, it's or fine. The, or the two thirds of a beer. I mean, two thirds of a beer hits different when you're recording a podcast. That's the thing. It also yeah. hits different when you're on a lot of medication. Like, also, yeah. yeah. Sure. Also, uh, when you're Hitler. <laughs> 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 